Welcome back to another episode of Go Little Garage. Today we have the Lego Technic Chopper. We're going on two wheels, not four. Uh, this is kit number 42132. It came out in January of 2022. This is part of the Technic series. Uh, it's for ages seven plus. It is 163 pieces, still available retail. Uh, we'll put the link down below to lego.com. If you click that, you'll be supporting us, so please definitely do. So uh, let's get started. Looks like we got a couple bags, a couple tires, a little rear tire, a little skinny front tire. So let's get going. Lego Technic Chopper. I wasn't a fan of this one. Number one, this is loose here. There's some clever bits to it. The chain turns the, the engine. I don't think you can see that from there, but it turns a little crankshaft that makes the little tiny pistons go up and down. That's, that's kind of cool. The steering, that's kind of cool how they figured that out. It's really super flimsy. I would have liked to see a double joint there, not just a single. Uh, I would have liked to see a clear piece for the headlight, not just a sticker. Uh, I would have liked to see a red transparent piece for the tail light and not just a sticker. Uh, like I said, this seat flopping around, I, I don't like that. The flow of how these stickers get put on was annoying. I kind of screwed up lining them up uh, because of how the flow is. The flow on these stickers on when you put these two pieces on also, and the, the stickers are so tiny. I would have liked the scene uh, some silk screen rather than stickers, but I get it. It's it's an inexpensive kit, so that would have been added cost. So I mean, I understand that, but still a little bit annoying. All in all, it's a cool little kit, but it's really, really flimsy. Everything on it moves. It's not one that you can play with. It's not one for kids to build and and play with afterwards. It's one to build and display if you're a fan, a motorcycle fan. The exhaust here as well, I didn't really like how that looks uh, and how they did that. And there's a piece falling out already. I was frustrated with this one as I was building it because the instructions should have combined some things. Uh, should have put some stickers on a little bit earlier if you're gonna do stickers. And it, it should have combined a couple steps. Uh, it just kind of drew it out and 
there were some pieces that you didn't secure. You just kind of rested them on there for a second and then a step later you'd secure them. And some steps could have been combined, some steps could have been rearranged, and I think just some other pieces could have been used. I think they could have done a lot better on this. And I get that it's an inexpensive kit and they need to make it as inexpensively as possible and keep costs down, but you know, with the years of LEGO engineering that are out there and the other kits that they have that are just really clever and how they find solutions to make things happen, make things work. This one's disappointing. This one's very disappointing, um, especially the engine. It, it's cool, it's clever to see the little engine, the little moving engine down there, but the engine sides, uh, it like I, the best word I have for it is disappointing. Overall, it wasn't bad. It took some time. It was fun. It's a Lego build. Uh, you get the automatic fun for that. But yeah, this is the Lego Technic Chopper.